Tonight, we're hearing from the family of a 23-year-old man allegedly shot and killed by two 15-year-olds in Salt Lake City earlier this month. Now, his family not only wants to remember him, but they're asking for accountability. It was outside this Salt Lake City apartment building on October 13th on 6th East and 2nd South, where 23-year-old Rory Swim died. Later that day, Rory's family heard the news from detectives. He then informed us that Rory had been shot and was fatally murdered. And that's how our day unfolded. Police say two 15-year-olds allegedly shot and killed Rory. Now his family is asking for justice. These guys' little egos, and they wanted to be big men that day. They all wanted to be the big man, didn't they? That's how they need to be treated now, like men. Over two weeks later, they say their lives changed. It's unbearable. I, I would never wish this on any other family. I don't understand why it keeps happening to families in this country. I don't understand it. Again, I don't. Hoping for closure for what happened here. We can't let Rory just die here on the corner of, of a street here. We're not that family. Remembering the one they love. Now, one of the 15-year-olds accused of shooting Rory is scheduled in court this Wednesday. The other teen was released from detention last week. Documents show the state does not plan to file any charges against that teen at this time.